In less than an hour, City Council member Augie Tolba will be hosting an e-bike and bicycle community roundtable at Elima Intermediate School in Eva Beach. To learn more about this event, let's now go there live and talk to Council member Tolba. Augie, good to see you again. Thank you for joining us. So why did you decide to host this roundtable? Why was it necessary? Well, Rick, you know, in the last couple of months and years, there have been several incidents uh, here in my community and the district. We know about what happened at Eva Makai at the crosswalk two years ago in 2022. A 13-year-old boy got killed using an e-bike. So the staff and I decided it was a good time to educate the public to see how we can help them get information on using the e-bikes and your regular bike and, and the importance of using a helmet. <laughs> Yeah, as you mentioned, uh, you know, some schools have decided to ban e-bikes. What makes them so dangerous? Well, first off, you know, parents need to know that to operate an e-bike, you need to be at least 15 years old. In order to buy one, 18 years old. So a lot of parents need to understand that, that this is a moving vehicle and can be very dangerous. So... If you're under 15 years old, you shouldn't be riding an e-bike. And I know you kicked off a social media campaign to raise awareness about e-bike safety. Can you tell us a little bit about that campaign? Yeah, you know, not only are we trying to make it fun, but we also want to make it so informative so that it connects with the young people in our community and people who are not paying attention to the law. So. It's important that one, you always should be using a, a helmet and you shouldn't be packing on an e-bike. It's very dangerous, it goes pretty fast. And then, you know, we live in a society that, you know, we use the word aloha a lot and a lot of these e-bikes are silent and the kupunas are walking, exercising and we have to show some courtesy to them also. Okay. Thank you so much, Councilman Tubba. We appreciate your time tonight. Thank you.